The number of pairs x comma y satisfying the equation sin x plus sin y equal to sin of x plus y and mod x plus mod y is equal to 1. And so mod x plus mod y is equal to 1. Sin, sin 0.5 plus sin 0.5, sin 1, sin 0.5 plus sin minus 0.5. What does it become? And so how are we going to approach this? Mod x plus mod y is equal to 1. And that much we know. And so clearly this is one set of numbers, values that will work. Let's put y equal to minus x. Sin x plus sin minus x. Sin of x plus minus x. This is sin x minus sin x. This is sin 0. Sin 0 is 0. This works. If you put y equal to minus x, this works. And so very simple, very wonderful idea. And so if you put that, then x mod x plus mod of minus x is equal to 1. That means mod x is equal to half. Mod minus x is mod x. x could be half, y could be minus half. Or x could be minus half, y could be half. Those two pairs work. Plus and minus. Anything else, this won't work. And or will it? Is there some other value that works? 3 by 4, 1 by 4, 3 by 4 minus 1 by 4, 3 by 4 plus 1 by 4. The numbers are very small. So you don't have to solve this algebraically. Mm -hmm. Writing the equation sin x cos y plus cos x sin y is very time consuming. The other value we can think of, we stick one of them as 0. Let's put y is 0. Then sin x plus sin 0, which is 0 sin x y equal to 0 works that means x could be mod x is 1 that is x could be 1 or minus 1 the opposite one will also work x equal to 0 y is 1 or minus 1 will work or we have 0 comma 1 0 comma minus 1 1 comma 0 minus 1 comma 0 half comma minus half minus half comma half six pairs but it's only these six when you should should have the confidence to say these six and nothing more because the other values you don't have to worry because sine three by four plus sine one by four is not going to be equal to sine one that's not happening right so you don't have to worry about that so f of x plus f of y equal to f of x plus y sine is not a function like that so you're effectively looking for trivial conditions where sine x equal to sine y simplify and and, and get that put x equal to we're looking at additive inverse and simplifications like that so the the only other possibility you probably have to think about is when y equal to x even that kind of eliminates itself it doesn't work and so there are six different pairs that will satisfy this